Sixers, hello, happy Tuesday. Very excited, Taco Bell dropped just a plethora of things the last few weeks. And today, the loaded taco fry burrito. This thing has a spicy ranch on that and some of the nacho cheese, bunch of other stuff. So today, let's go snag a couple of them, review them, talk about burritos. Let's go. Alright guys, fries and a burrito. This is the loaded taco fry burrito from Taco Bell acquired jump cut. Before we feast, Corey Wagner second angle. Alright, let's see what we got. Hopefully we can open it up. Looks like we can a little bit. Um, fries, tomatoes, cheese, lettuce, um, probably meat. Yeah, is it steak or beef? I don't know. It's a damn good question, my friend. We we'll might find have to out. bite into it. You can't unfold these too much. No. You're going to find yourself in a world of hurt. Yeah, I think uh, the burrito episodes are traditionally one of the more boring second angles because it's the hands how That's burritos work. Very true. <laughs> it's all busted open for the thumbnail. I'm not a psycho. People always comment and they think I eat my burritos like that. I swear I don't. <laughs> Alright, there's no way, way this can be bad. Taco Bell, brand new burrito full of fries. Cheers. Cheers. A lot of cheese, that's good. Yeah, a lot of nacho cheese. I love the seasoning of the fries. We've talked about this a million times. I love putting potatoes in my burritos. Mm -hmm. Whether it's like diced potatoes or fries or tots. I've done it before. It's just so much more enjoyable. I love the texture and the taste. Another good move, croutons in yeah. burritos. Oh, and this has those crunchy red strips. There's just so mm -hmm. much texture going on in here. This is just an innovation station, dude. That very much is bringing to the table what the croutons bring, a little bit of crunch. Absolutely. I started doing that after I met you, and just when people asked, I said, yeah, I came up with that. I mm. stole that, and I was 1% cooler, but more of a douche. Wow. Yeah, this is really good. So good. Three bucks and some change. Mm -hmm. It's not a bad price. Not at all. It's a great promo item. That bite had a lot of spicy ranch. It was very good. My bite finally had some of the crunchies. Yeah. My first half of this was crunchy-less, or crunchless. Crunchless, yeah. When you can find that that perfect bite, the epicenter of all the flavors, mm -hmm. nothing like it, dude. Feels very man versus fries. Yeah. But like the JV style. Maybe, Absolutely. Maybe freshman team even. Yeah, like ninth graders. Mm, 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 mm. I found all my crunchy spots and it's getting really good. And I'll say this, is gonna be a very probably dumb but shocking thing to say. I actually really like the coolness of like the lettuce and, and the tomato in this. It kind of like also provides another layer. I, th I really think they did a, a counterbalance. Job. It's a perfect counterbalance. Mm 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 mm. It was great. Like in this show, like you're the meat and the fries and the sauce, and I'm just like the lettuce and the tomato. If I accent you, I'm not completely necessary, but it's good that I'm there. It, that, that was just the, the most awesome uh, speech that I've ever heard. Mmm, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. that was good. Also, new vlog out on my channel if you want to check it out. Head over to one of my favorite places in the city, Garfield Park Conservatory, mm -hmm. baby. want to sneak back into the employees only right. spot Always. I'm not going back there but I want to what I tell you about breaking the rules and Th that they're meant to much. be broken That's no right I told you I'm gonna stop going in public with you <laughs> <laughs> whoa he straight up drove over the curb cool man I bet his dick is so small <laughs> oh this is great I ate tomatoes and then there's probably a couple people who were excited about it that mm -hmm. I didn't throw a tomato out the window, but then this little guy fell out. One little teeny tiny So tomato. now I can just uh, go ahead and whop! Just a piss you off, mm -hmm. guys and gals. You're uh, a great pleasure. Tomato toss is now extended into the northwest suburbs. Uh-huh. The quarry map is growing. That's right. Tomatoes all over this town. Guys, don't forget to like this video. It helps number six with cheese a lot. Uh, helps the algorithm, helps more people see it. Uh, we've been trying to get way more likes on the videos. It's been helping a lot. So don't forget to hit the like button. Subscribe. We put up videos every single week. Uh, every single weekday. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Um, and before we go ahead and rate that and assign a numerical value to it based on other or Taco Bell and burrito-like things in the fast food world. Let's do a shout out. Patreon shout out, Patreon shout out, Patreon shout out. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, we've got a Patreon page. Uh, it's patreon.com forward slash number six with cheese. 
It is, in my opinion, the best way to help support us. It's a way that we have, like, it's a way for us to grasp and understand how much money we have coming in every month and know that we'll be able to keep ourselves afloat. So it really does help a ton. If we can get that number up just a, a little bit, if we double our, our Patreon support, that would be life literally life changing mm -hmm. for me and Sean. Oh yeah. So if you want to support and you also get kickbacks too, you get access to early videos, you get to hang out with us. We have a Zoom a private Zoom call that we do with our Patreon members once a month. Super super fun. Uh, all you got to do is donate, check out the tier that suits you best and um, get on board and it's not much if you really think about it. As low as 10 bucks a month, which is like less way less than a dollar, less than 50 cents a video. Mm -hmm. Um, so if you think about it that way, like, oh, you're giving a quarter every time you watch us and are entertained by us, yeah. like, that really, you know, it really is helpful. So, uh, patreon.com forward slash number six of cheese, and anybody who donates, we um, do shout outs for. So here's a couple people who've donated recently. Patreon shout out name number one, Miss Cindy Brown. Down there in Florida, has supported the show since day one. She calls herself the, the number 11 fan. She thinks she was about, probably around 11. Uh, but Cindy donates $35 a month. That means she gets to pick where we eat. She gets an episode kind of dedicated to her, and the whole, whole cuisine is based on what she wants us to get. Uh, so if you want to be like Cindy, donate that amount. And Cindy, thank you so much. You're, you're also one of the highest Patreon donors lifetime, uh, and that means the world to us. So from the bottom of our uh, taco-ridden hearts, thanks. And Patreon shout out number two goes Mr. Brian Yaxic. Brian, an absolute legend uh, on our show. He's He's been a supporter from day one, it feels like. He's bought in a bunch of merch. He's got been a Patreon multiple times. He's super awesome. He went from the $20 tier and then bumped himself up to the $35 Ooh. tier. Just awesome, awesome move. I can't tell you how much it helps and how much we appreciate it, Brian. And not only appreciate your support on Patreon, but across the board, you've been a big supporter, commenter, liker of the videos, and we appreciate that, buddy. All right, time to rate it. Three and some change, Taco Bell, limited time release. Uh, out of five fry, I think fryer basket, out of five fryer baskets, how many fryer baskets do you give the loaded taco, fry burrito, Three and some change, Corey. Uh, I think that's a great price. I love french fries on a burrito. I love crunchy stuff on a burrito. I love how much cheese they put on there. Um, I didn't get much of the, the that ranch flavor, but that's probably just because they did such a good job of cheesing it, mm -hmm. which I am all for, so no complaints there. Um, I think it's all around just a great meal for that price. I'm gonna give that a 4.8. Yeah, I'm glad you went that high. I was, um, very, I mean, I talked about it. Like all the different things that are in there, all accent each other really well. Like burritos, a lot of the times, like sometimes you just throw a ton of stuff in there, and you're like, well, it's because you like all those things. It actually all had purpose at a Taco Bell location. I really enjoyed that. Four point seven five. Wow. Wow. It's a damn near perfect score for a fast food item. Let us know if you guys have had that. What do you think of Taco Bell's fries? They take them away and they bring them back. They take them away and they bring them back. Do you like that? Do you like their fries? Let us know in the comments. And we're back here tomorrow for another video. A fun week, uh, a fun collab hopefully happening this week, and also uh, another local review here in Chicago. So come on back. See you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.